The end times are upon us. We require your shooty shooty bang bang services. Cheese, mashed potatoes, mushrooms, olives, chickpeas, etc. Motherland, fatherland, and boss, you are under arrest. I'm sorry, but boss will be representing themselves at this trial. So proof that zombies are hostile. Tell them, boss. Ooh, I really want to choose that sarcastic option. Shooting mechanics, guts pickups, starting town. Oh, this is kind of a hard one. I'm going to have to go sarcastic. <laughs> it's just, it's just the word sarcastic, isn't it? This is another fucking trap answer. <laughs> There's, oh, oh, okay. Thank you. Yeah, boss is supposed to say a sarcastic remark. No. <laughs> Ooh, okay. Um, yeah, uh, sorry, my mistake. Don't kick them out or anything. May I ask what the hell did you have a sarcastic remark there in the first place? <laughs> This game I, I apologize from the bottom of my heart objective proof that they are <laughs> okay probably the guts pickups um, I yeah I'm not sure what that had to actually do with anything okay damaging items well yes but there's also environmental hazards you and your friends right here had to derail the entire game so that you didn't see them yeah that doesn't mean my zombies were aggro also eating guts seriously I tried adding some shock value. Yeah, well, it didn't work. Two out of ten for effort. Boss, that doesn't prove that... Whew, okay, we're not doing... We're not doing so much. Uh, oh, we're not doing so good here. Objective proof that they're hostile. <sighs> Shooting mechanics wouldn't be it. The starting town... Ooh, maybe the starting town. When I got into the starting town, I was protected by walls. Yeah, well, all human settlements are protected by walls. Have you considered why? You people are very protective. You lose your shit every time something is out of place in your little la-la land. Or maybe it's due to zombies. Come again? The shopkeeper and the priest talked about the end times. Tell me, Zed, how did zombies come about? I reckon there weren't any zombies before those times. We rose from the graves one day. Loud noises, crazy sky, thunder, fire. Sounds like an apocalypse to me. Yes, I remember that happening. A week ago. Yes, those are indeed the signs of the end times. A week ago? That's when the walls were built to keep the zombies out. And, to top it all off, the gatekeeper advised me to have a weapon at my hand because the zombies outside haunt humans. That's just because someone says something, that doesn't mean it's true. The guy wouldn't let me out of the gate until I got an old pipe from the shopkeeper. So considering the walls were built to protect survivors from zombies, that you rose from an apocalypse, that I was advised to have a weapon on me at all times, and considering Motherland's and Fatherland's testimonies, yes, it seems abundant evidence that zombies are hostile toward humans. Sweet, my trust went back up. But thank you, Mr. Zed. I think we've cleared the massacre allegation. Goodbye. Well, I can't say you people aren't efficient. Where did Zed go, anyway? Moving right along here, our second allegation is conspiracy. I assume that's your allegation. Uh, correct. While you've managed... I thought music came out of nowhere. While you've managed to vindicate yourself of murder, I reckon it'll be harder to vindicate yourself from conspiracy, boss. What do you mean by conspiracy? Playing dumb now, huh? You know what I'm talking about, the phone call, the forest, the plans to kill me. You two are supposed to be my... But you two are supposed to be villains, professional killers in a land without law. Everyone sitting next to that table were supposed to have a big epic boss fight at the end. But no, you people just had to fuck it all up with... Whew. But no, you people just had to fuck it all up, didn't you? You weren't happy with your role, your 15 minutes of glory. How would you feel if you knew how and when you'd die? We broke the system to free everyone from your quest, abolish evil, and just live in peace. Acute ideology. Acute ideology. I bet you love clinging to it because that's because you just want to save yourselves. Order, order. 
says the person who started an apocalypse for some bullshit grand adventure. This is a video game. You people are not real. The only one who is, is boss. God damn it, my fourth wall is going to be so sore after this. <laughs> Order. Okay. The trial isn't about you, it's about boss. Let's hear what boss has to say about all of this. Finally, a sensible idea. This one. The God damn it, this game is getting really pretentious. What? What's the next? Some kind of bullshit moral message saying that the only way to win the game is to not play at all? No, I'm just... This is a very stupid game and you're all taking it way too seriously. How the fuck did we get from a comedy game to a philosophical discussion about fictional characters again? Well, I guess boss is right. Yeah, so little self-awareness is always good. I'm sorry, people. I just wanted to make something exciting and interesting, and it seems I got from cheesy fourth wall breaks to pretentious ones. I guess it's the sort, the thing that happens when you write by the seat of your pants. Heartwarming. So, uh, can we leave this drab courthouse and go back to the shooting game thing? Yeah, at least that was fun. Yeah, sure. Let's kill some zombies. The writing in this game is still kind of, eh, yeah, I feel like this is the Matrix idea, but a bit overused nowadays. Do you want to shoot zombies or not? Come on, boss, let's go. Oh, man. Oh, no. There's so many zombies. What? Okay, so that didn't really answer any of my questions about this game, but I'm definitely definitely having a lot more fun than I did in that courtroom. So, I, I guess thank you for making this game. This game is the most fun I've had playing something in a while. Aw, it's over. Okay, so... I may end up doing another episode on this, and it'll be more, uh... Maybe I'll see about the other endings. Apparently there's two more endings. So we'll see. We'll see what I end up doing. I... I'll... I, I probably will, because <laughs> I really like this game. Um, thank you for making it. This is, as I said again, the most fun I've had in the game. If you haven't played it, you have got to play this game. And... Thank you guys who are watching this, and uh, I guess I'll see you in the next episode.